Sanishara Kliwon Kuningan is the day that we as a Hindus celebrate Kuningan Day every 210 days or 10 days after Galungan. It's time for me to go to the temple and enjoy the video. Galungan and Kuningan days are highly awaited celebrations for people in Bali. Galungan falls on Buddha Kliwon Dungulan, which means the victory of Dharma or goodness against a Dharma or evil. Meanwhile, Kuningan Day falls on Sanischara Kliwon Kuningan, where Hindus worship the gods to ask for safety and protection. The day before Galungan or Kuningan, we called it Penampahan, where Penampahan itself has the meaning of welcoming. On this day, the people will be busy with ngelawar or sacrificing animals for ceremonial facilities and making penjor. Penjor is a decorated bamboo with a palm leaf, rice paddy, and some fruit like coconut uh, and some uh, jajan or uh, Balinese cakes. And what penjor means is uh, penjor is symbolized of gunung or mountain, which symbolizes of Mount Agung. So that's why in penjor there is some fruits, some uh, root, a bit like a beetroot, and some decoration. This means like a forest in the mountain. One day after the penampahan, we celebrate Galungan or Kuningan. As Hindus, we pray at the temples and also at the house temple, we call it Murajan or Sangha. And many people go to their hometown also to pray and family gathering. After that, we usually do Ngiring or we follow the Sasuhunan or symbolism of God around the village. Then, one day after the Galungan or Kuningan day, we call it Umanis, which traditionally the children will do the barong dance on the street or we call it Malawang. Galungan and Kuningan teach us to always be kind so that our lives are peaceful. And that's the end of our vlogs. I hope you guys enjoy it as much as we do. And thank you so much for watching. Bye!